using a globe and a map. A globe is a small spherical representation or model of the Earth. It shows how the Earth is tilted and how it spins on an imaginary line known as an axis. It also shows the location of various continents and oceans. Maps show the Earth on a flat or plain surface. Maps are usually colored in various shades of green, yellow, brown, and blue to depict the different features such as plains, deserts, mountains, and water bodies. There are some common symbols that map makers all over the world have agreed to use. These symbols help us to understand maps better. These are called conventional symbols. If we know the symbols and the standard colors used on maps, we can understand maps even if they are printed in a language we do not know. Look at the relief and political maps of India. Different kinds of maps show different features. Some may cover one particular theme and hence they are called thematic maps. Some may show the physical features of a region. These are known as relief maps. A political map will show countries, their boundaries, the states, and the capitals. An atlas provides maximum information within a minimum amount of space. So to get full advantage of an atlas, we must be able to infer what the colors and symbols used stand for.